day three or four. I don't know which. And arena walk time. Yay. Um, I'm just sorting myself out for the arena walk. Um, I've just given Archie a brush and put his saddle and stuff on and then just popping his bridle on while I come back and get my hat and boots together and then we've got a pretty chill day um, because my test isn't until um, like just after half five um, so we don't really need to be doing anything I think we're going to take him for a hat later because um, he can't really stay in the stable all day um, but we also need to wash his legs off because they're gross and um, wash his legs and what was the other thing? Oh and I'm going to pop our Protect Master boots on him. Um, there's nothing wrong with his legs whatsoever, he's done really well with travelling and competing but um, yeah just to make sure that he's feeling tip top. Um, I'll pop those on in a bit but we'll have to wait for his legs to dry. Um, it's meant to be like 24, 25 degrees here today I think. So we might also test out our new ice rug that we got, which is exciting. Um, but yeah, I'm going to go do the arena walk. Shiny here. You're such a shiny boy. Actually, like I'm not going to do it. <laughs> he like there's too much in there. So, um, there's been like zero footage since this morning, just because it's been such a quiet day. Um, since we did the arena walk um, and washed him off, he's been pretty much left alone all day. Um, I've just got changed now and it's uh, 5 to 5. Um, so, yeah. Um, we went in the shop and bought some bits and pieces of his voucher. And I also got a montage from the photo stand. Um, and, um, yeah, I think that was pretty much it. Um, probably way too many ice creams. Um, but yeah, we've just had a really chill day. Doing not a lot. Um, and I'm just getting changed now for my, um, music test. I've got my new Shires, um, top on. Because it's like 27 degrees here and it's got this on the back, so fingers crossed I'll be cool. And then my just jump breeches. Um, and then I'm just going to pop my three donkeys and cover all bottoms on to keep them clean. Um, as I have to do and brush him um, now. So yeah, um, I'm going to go brush him and I'll come back and sort my hair and all the last bits and pieces and then we'll go. <laughs>
You're good, Bob. Good boy. That's a big fish. <laughs> The podium, yeah, taps are broke 70%. To give you an idea of the standard of time position here. So, well done there, Captain Kirk Archie with a 68.89. So, in third place, let's have a look at the Just back from prize giving, and I'm now all ready for the disco. Archie came fourth in his music today so hopefully that'll put him in a good place for the rest of the challenge tomorrow um, but yeah we're gonna party now um and my hair is still gross so i'm gonna need some dry shopping <laughs> I filmed absolutely nothing today but I thought I'd talk to you quickly while I finish getting ready for my very last test of shoot gig 2019. Um, he was such a good boy in his test this morning, he scored 67.40 and we turned those fours into sevens um, that we got at the start of the week. Um, so it was such a good way to end um, the actual test. Now I've just got my music. Um, which will be fun. Hopefully I won't have to improvise today. Um, he came sick this morning, by the way. Um, yeah, he came sick. He missed out on fifth by naught point. Um, not point. Um, not point not two percent and fourth by naught point five percent. So it was a really close class, and he was. I think he was like naught point nine nine off of first place so it was incredibly tight um but yeah he was such a good boy um he is tired now so um but yeah i was just again after the test this morning i've not really done anything so there wasn't really any need or anything to film um we've been sat in here most of the day just looking for scores and stuff um so yeah apologies to be boring um, and I also keep thinking there's not a hell of a lot of horsey footage in this, but um, at the same time, I um, know that I've got to edit all my tests in, and once I don't have one video, I will um, record off the live stream probably to include. Um, but yeah, just music now, um, and then we are done. Um, but we're not going home until, we we'll probably have to put it on the right way. Um, but yeah, we're not going home until tomorrow. Um, but yeah, that's where we're at. Um, yeah, I'm just about to go and get on him. And yeah, wish us luck. Good boy. Good boy. 
for you second, Bob Bob. Yeah? <laughs> I kept right behind him, he was alright. Let me fly. We're away. So we are home safe now. Um, Archie's back out in the field. Um, and we just emptied the trailer and stuff back quickly before I show you everything that I got while I was at Sheep Gate. Um, excuse the state of my hair it's, and my face and everything. It's incredibly hot and I really need a shower. Um, yeah so i'll show you what's in this bag there um so we've got a brow band cover um from world's exclusive bling um they're just really useful and they stop all the diamantes falling out um our stable pack and then a pink lycra hood for archie um, that we picked up second hand from Lara at World's Exclusive Bling um, so yeah we haven't actually tried it on him yet but hopefully it will fit and it will keep him um, A clean and B it will stop him rubbing all those hair off um, then obviously we went in the shop <laughs> um, although the first things I'll show you aren't actually from the shop um, we got two um, sets of stirrup covers. Um, I don't have any, but I do have crystals or diamantes down the side of my stirrups, and a few of them have fallen out, so hopefully that will kind of stop that um, or prevent it while they're in storage. Um, then I got a pair of white gloves because if anyone's seen the photos, mine are gross. Um, but yeah, I got those. And I have some air um, and stuff in the back. Um, then I got a set, or well, just I say set, just two of the um, Franklin balls to try out, and the pump to go with them. And then I got Archie a new head collar. It's a, um, I'm not sure if people say it Katago or Katago. Actually, it's not even either. I'm a failure. Um. But yeah, got a new head collar. Um, looks like so. Um, I'm yet to try it on him, but I think it'll look really good. And this is kind of like leather like, so hopefully it'll be a bit harder for him to trash. Um, then uh, I'll show you my rosettes and stuff. Um, so, um, these rosettes, oh, man. these rosettes are all obviously kindly sponsored, um, by different companies, so a massive thank you to everyone that, um, does sponsor these rosettes and make everything at Sheepgate possible. Um, so I'll start with the ones we actually got on the first day. So on the first day we have this one, which was sponsored by Sue Cars and Saddles, um, and that was fifth. Um, in his warm up test then this one which is sponsored by I'm not sure if it's Katago or Katago or something like that and that was 10th in his semi final test um, then we didn't get any rosettes on the second day he was equal 13th in a class of about 40 but there was loads of people in equal placings um, it was a bit of an odd class with the scores um, but yeah, he was equal 13th in that, and then he gained 17th in the final. 
um, then on day three, which was Friday, he came um, fourth in his music in the first part of the Digicourse Challenge. Um, and then yesterday he came sixth in the normal test part of the Digital Horse Challenge. Um, and second in his music. Um, which is sponsored by Myla Bits. Um, and then he came fourth overall in the Digital Horse Challenge. Um, and he also got the sweet and treat bag handed out to him in the or on the first day of the Digital Horse Challenge. But he can't really have any because he's allergic to the treats. Um, he can't have any like cereals or whatever. Um, and we also won a Sue Carson polo shirt, which is embroidered front and back, um, for coming fifth, which was really, really nice. And then in here, I'll just show you my pictures quickly. Um, and then I bought a montage of the Super Cop himself. Um, so yes, that is pretty much Sheepgate 2019. I had the most incredible time ever. Um, Archie completely blew everyone away, it wasn't just me, um, he shocked everyone, um, but yeah, he was just amazing, and I'm really excited to go back next year, hopefully, and hopefully improve on what we've done this year, but I think we've had a pretty solid start, um, I think it's really helped to cement our partnership, um, and yeah, I'm feeling really motivated now to push on and achieve the rest of our goals that we have for this year, um, so yeah, a massive thank you to everyone that made it possible, to everyone at home who looked after the boys while we were away, um, my parents obviously, um, everyone at Sheepgate that made the event run as smoothly as it did, um, all the stewards and officials and whatever, everyone that gave up their time, um, and yeah, just everyone for making it amazing, all the sponsors, um, yeah, everyone was just and everything was just amazing i had the most amazing amazing time um and yeah i'm so excited for next year now hopefully fingers crossed but you never know what happened with horses um thank you so so much for watching and also remember to check out digital horse who is the kind of whole reason behind all of this um so yeah make sure you check out digital horse i'll leave the website link in the bio the description um, so you can check that out, they've also got a competition, I'm not sure if they're all finished, um, but they have competitions all the time, but at the moment, or when I'm filming this, if you sign up, then you are automatically entered into a competition to win a Lingu Selkoff emblazoned or embroidered um, with their logo. So make sure you follow them on Instagram as well, um, sign up and stay tuned for more competitions because I'm sure they'll have loads.